My name is Hyeyoung Lee from Korean American Community Services. Um, I am a director of Senior Services and Public Benefit. And I'm Darby Moorhart and I am a faculty member on the ARC Steering Committee and I'm the Director of Education for the uh, Cognitive Neurology and Alzheimer's Disease Center here at Northwestern. Okay, and so how has taking a community-engaged approach helped your work or influenced your work? Well, I um, think that uh, I'm a little unique and sometimes when I hear these discussions about academics and among academics, um, I'm kind of late, later to the research and piece and I've been a clinician for many years. I'm a social worker and so a lot of what I bring to this is the value of um, the empowerment um, of the community and of individuals and of relationship building. And so I come to that with those values already and um, it, I'm more I'm really later to the whole research process here but um, what I can say is that we have um, what I can bring um, I can bring those values to our overall cognitive neurology and Alzheimer's disease center which is an NIA funded Alzheimer's center and so I'm working with a lot of researchers who don't necessarily have that same um, um, understanding of how to involve the community in research. And then how has you know, being involved in quote-unquote community-engaged research influenced the work you do at Korean American Family Services? Um, I didn't know what to expect actually coming into this uh, CBPR, um, learning about CBPR. But um, it's been almost a year, I think, uh, since I've been involved with this uh, group and ARC and part of the SEED grant um, program. And I have learned tremendous um, things about uh, CBPR approach and how to be part of it and how to be more advocate for our community and where I am from. Um, and I have, I feel like it's a process of learning things and then luckily we received this SEED grant um, where we can just uh, build the par partnership and learning about each other. So I have learned a lot about what Darby is doing and I have also shared a lot about what we are doing and where our com communities are at. So we could kind of learn about each other and uh, also that has, uh, not only that I had done a lot of like, participated in a lot of workshops or um, conferences, a lot of meetings that talks a lot of this concept or this acronyms that I did not know before. I was realizing today like how much I actually understand some of these acronyms that was said in, in the meeting. Uh, so that really helped me to kind of gain uh, more knowledge about being uh, what it is about doing research, not just research but CBPR approach research, which really helped me and I felt like I am more equipped than a year ago and I'm, yeah, I'm glad that I have really great partner Darby and we are, um, I think we are doing great. We're doing very well for it. <laughs> so, so what's next for you guys? Um, uh, we are we apply for um, implementation grant um, so we are trying to um, if we receive the funding we are gonna do um, the, the qualitative study for um, the health attitude about Alzheimer's disease among Korean Americans um, so we're thinking about doing uh, three focus groups and uh, possibly more and some uh, interviews individual interviews with the people so we can kind of capture uh, what what the needs of the Korean community in terms of how to deal with our time disease. Do you feel like this work would have been possible without the support of ARC or CERT? That this project would have happened otherwise? I really doubt that this would have happened without the support of ARC. Um, this was something that, I mean, ARC really brought us together. Um, you, they actually spoke with you first and right. then you had identified Alzheimer's disease as an area that you really wanted to focus right. and then um, ARC introduced Young to me and right. so the two of us started to talk and really saw the potential in building this partnership right. so I doubt that we would have really met each other or, or be in this place today had it not been right. for, for ARC. 
it's kind of like matchmaking <laughs> and relationship building, right? We're still together. So. <laughs> we are still, we are still together. <laughs> anything else you want to add? Um, well, anything else? Yeah. So, hopefully, we receive yeah. funding and we can yes. continue to do the work yes. that we are um, committed to do. I feel like both of us yes. are really committed to do things together. Yeah. So absolutely, cool. we're learning a lot from each other. Yeah, I think that's what's been. Yeah. So. Um, Fantastic. Right. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it.